has cash accumulation. It doesn't have ROP, return of premium, like the, like the signature G will, but it's very low cost. But look at the guarantee death note. You can dial the guarantee as low as age 80. Remember the G, the signature G well, the first G well product we looked at today, uh, this morning, guaranteed at least 95. But what if you only want to go to life expectancy, 80, 85, 90? Here's, a, here's an option for you. I want my guarantee to go longer, but not for life. I just give me the life expectancy. Uh, great option for you, but also cash buildup inside. You know, people like to see the cash sometimes. So it's, you have options. You have our G well that's, hey, it's all about death benefit. I don't, I'm not worried about cash. I'd go signature G well. I like the cash bill though. I want to maybe pull it out, but I want that guarantee assurance of the death benefit. This might be a good option for you. Signature protection IUL. Well. Here's just an example of the signature protection IUL well we just discussed in terms of the low cost premiums of the NLG. That's a 10, a 10 pay and a full pay. Uh, we have more time, which again, we could go all day. I can show you the cash values versus the competition. They're strong. They're not market leading, but they're right there. They're right in the mix, which is really what you want. When you combine it with the low guarantees and the cash value, it's strong. Whole life. Now, whole life's another right. Now, you'll have clients who say, I love the whole life because I had a good experience with this old whole life product. And, and I like to guarantee cash values and death benefit and premiums. Now, don't compare this product to a leading cash value whole life play, like a New York Life or Mass Mutual or Guardian. But if you just want Competitive, low cost premium to endow to 121, which simply, essentially, you pay for life and you get everything's guaranteed. But this one's unique in the sense that the premiums are very low versus typical whole life products. The guaranteed premiums. And you could short pay it, even single pay it in some cases. Let's put it all together, low minimum face of 10,000. We have a lot of grandparents who gift a 10,000 life policy to their grandchildren. They pay it for 10 years and then they wash their hands and now you have this kid has this legacy product for life that they can use for buying their first condominium or helping college loans off or using for their own apartment. You see these 10,000 policies over the course of lifetime, starting at a, a two year old, going for 80 years on it. So pretty good compound you'll see. So don't overlook these small cases that can lead to big sales or, and oh by the way, I need something for my grandchild. Throw it in Is there a question real quick? Yeah, is this uh, your sort of final expense product? We don't call it that, but you can call it that. Because it may, <laughs> because it may go through full underwriting with the larger face amounts, but at the smaller face amounts, it'll go through our Express and Express Plus underwriting. I'm gonna show you what that means. So in some cases, the smaller face amounts may be accelerated quickly. And what is the age limit? This one is also, um, boy, it's 80 or 85. For some reason, I'm thinking 85. It's good. Okay. okay. And uh, here's a 10 pack. Just showing you the low cost print. This has to be New York, but it's the same concept out there. Just to give you an idea, strong product, competitive. By the way, you know that we're out of the term space. We also eliminated the term riders on this product. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We can revisit that in the future. It's a lot of term. I know. I was sensitive to that. But maybe not. <laughs> we, we, we may revisit that. But I, I, don't, I don't know. But anyway, well, the product itself on a permanent side is uh, very price competitive. Now, here's that accelerated under I was alluding to. Uh, anyone 65 and under goes through Express. Under 250. We have no preferred classes below there. All in all, um, Submit the app, no client phone interview. Fill out the full application, part one, part two. And then we'll, we're gonna run our background check on uh, more deals going forward, medical information bureau, prescription database check. You can Lexus Nexus. Yeah, so we do that under essentially a million. So the point is, Express with about seven out of 10 gets approved without additional requirements, give or take, a percentage. And Express Plus has to be an electronic application. Has to be electronic apps. Uh, up to a million age 50, half a million age 60, all in all. Do you have a method for people, for agents that are not contracted to run quotes through a system? Because like expert, expert app obviously requires you to have a contract. Do you have a software method where people can run GE low quotes or even IE low quotes? No, no. I mean, you don't have to run it, or an appointed agent will have to run it, or I can run it. 
Dude, you made a call, man. You guys, thank you. Wait, you're talking about submitting business or writing quotes? Writing quotes, like, yeah. like a Winflex, like a third party software. Yeah, we allow you to do that. All you have to do, either Winflex, all you have to do is contact Winflex directly through your where you're already doing your quotes and request American National. It's not an issue. We do have to approve it. So if it's you requesting, we typically want you to be appointed. But it even, should be. even Winflex, you can't run it if you're not appointed with them. You yeah, have to be yeah that's what I was going to say. Up. Yeah. Um, There's no method in okay. So, you can always call me, I can write quotes for you. I'm sure you have options. So, right. This is why I say this. Okay. And, and this is maybe something you can take to your higher ups that could help. Yeah. I, I prefer Anico's GUL over any other carrier we have right now. You know, we have Nationwide to pick from, we have North American to pick from, we I prefer yours. If you guys have higher percentage limits on your living benefits and your underwriting, process is a lot more streamlined. But I have agencies that will lean on North American mm -hmm. because their non-licensed agents can run quotes with North American's software and submit while they're still in JIT status and they don't have a writing number. Yeah. And so that's what sometimes pinches the ability for us to run more of this. If they've never been appointed, one thing that you may or may not be aware of, if they aren't appointed, they still can submit business. Uh, if they're not appointed, the longer they're not active, the longer they're not active with another agent, and they can take the action. As so long as they've submitted contract for maybe a day or two, but it's a paper route. Paper route. Yeah. So, and, and, and electronic. You're, you're talking to the younger. <laughs> I, like, I, won't, I won't touch a paper route. <laughs> so you you got to be appointed first. You know what? Get appointed ASAP. <laughs> 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 That's what's the joke. Okay, so that we'll contact like you, and you'll do it for us, yes. and then we decide. If Absolutely. I'll give you my car before I leave. Okay. <laughs> um, just, re just remember, y'all, that y'all do have UMS that's there. When your VP is not right. there, I UMS know. is there so then. Yeah, so yeah, we'll yeah. take care of that. You have options. We have our field support center, but we'll probably ask for your team. And Nisha will do that as well, too. you got your team, myself. we you got plenty of options if you're not able to. Okay. Um, but the, we do allow you to pre-appoint without an application. So you, you don't have to. Now this not may work for your model and we're cool with that, but I encourage you if you don't have an app ready, you can go ahead and get a, a, a pre-appointment. We want the app, but if you don't need an app with the contract. Some carriers, if you're in the contract, I need you need to do just in time. Anyway, so we're gonna wrap up. Which is your credit underwriting. Just want to let you know, hey, you got a great price product, but what if you can't underwrite? Got some tools in our tool bag that help us get those table to the standards type to help improve the cases. So if you're a non-smoker, you think that 60 or underwriters are going to use this precision credit underwriting. You don't, you don't have to, like, um, I mean, they should apply it automatically, but you can, hey, did you use the precision credit? Can you double check? Odds are they have. They're going to apply it. It's applicable. <laughs> Put it all together. Don't forget our living benefits critical. <laughs> critical product terminal on every policy. There's only a couple requirements, uh, essentially. Table four better or a flat extra, no worse than five dollars per thousand, uh, and fifty thousand a credit or greater. So most cases will have that. so fifty thousand a greater, table four or better, essentially. Uh, Minimum face value AUL well, twenty five. Twenty five thousand. The only exception to that is the protection IUL well, is two fifty minimum. Okay. So the GI will be higher. Be aware of that. So living benefits, big part of our. If you're not talking living benefits, the next agent will. So, hey, do you have the outdated kind of insurance or the updated kind? Well, what do you mean by that? Then you tell them, well, do you have living benefits on your on your life policy? What a great uh, excuse to just get into a conversation. Well, what do you mean by that? I, I don't want outdated stuff. I want the new stuff. Just like uh, phones have evolved, so is life insurance. You know, there's, you know, before you could just like, uh, Take calls and receive phone calls. Now you know all the things we could do with phone calls. Just like life insurance, a lot of more advancements in life insurance. More than just a death benefit. There's cash benefit, there's loans, there's a rider, there's a return of premium, go on and on. So the point is, don't overlook. Yeah, Tony. No waiting period, is that just on chronic then you're saying? Because critical is 30, oh, no wait, which, which one's the no policy waiting period? Uh, there's no policy waiting period. There is a couple exceptions in states like Arizona. <coughs> 30 days for critical, 90 days for chronic. In other words, you could make a claim immediately as long as it's 30 days uh, 
30 days, you know what that means, there's no waiting for your period, but we're talking about the illness itself. The illness itself, so. Meaning you would have had to have, like, let's say, cancel for 30 days? Wait a second, wait a second. No, Steve, did you help me out on that one? Yeah, so there's no policy waiting period to have it on your policy, but once you have a trigger on your bed, it's 30 days to make the claim, or 90 days to make the claim, I think. Mm -hmm. yeah, absolutely. It's uh, well within the industry standards, that's my point. Um, you have, <laughs> you have the next one, but you do have one year to make the claim. Yeah, we recommend, though, if you have a, an event, a chronic illness you think, that would qualify, or we recommend you do it immediately, before you have all the, 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 the prescription, the resolution, the surgery. We want the uncertainty, so to speak. We want the client to be up. You know, but in terms of getting the most out of your claim, file an ASAP if you think it's an option. Do you have the guaranteed insurability right of it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, on all of our products, we have the guaranteed uh, insurability rider uh, to 20, 25,000. Six times? Yeah, yeah. Some good stuff on that. Um, Critical illness, I mean, think critical illness, think, think events, heart attack, stroke, and basic cancer. So most carriers don't have critical, some do. Uh, we have as many triggers as anyone in red is not available in California. Okay, our new IUL. Uh, I'm sorry if you're dragging on, but I want to get to all this good stuff. But the point is, we made this product more competitive in general. We lowered the cost of insurance. We increased the target premiums by about 20%. I'm going to show you some other things. And basically, we, we took something that was good to, I believe, now great. And it's all compliant with all the latest rules. You may have heard AG49B word for that, which means you can't over-illustrate, over-promise. And carriers have to get themselves in line with signature performance on your well is our accumulation on your well. So this is kind of our positioning in the market now. So it's among the most competitive. Now, carriers are catching up with their compliant products like National Life, I just saw them, a couple others, put it all together. Very competitive in the marketplace in general in terms of cash bill, cash flow, and you'll get paid more. Now anything in green, you probably won't know it unless you sold our previous performance on well. But just old versus new, this to give you an idea of how refreshed it is. Springtime at American National. <laughs> <laughs> Five to Seven, eight, ten percent. The cash value has increased in year 20. Uh, so anything in green is an improvement on the cash value. This is the same thing, but on cash flow or distribution on the solves at various ages in various underwriting classes from 10 to 20 percent increase. So this is a big deal. And if you want a competitive IUL or supplemental retirement, death benefit, creating financing, this is a good vehicle for it. Question. Yeah. So um, I, lo I wrote a lot of Anico over the past couple years. So I, I'm just asking is, will, the, will those clients, they're going to see these improvements too as well based on no. how I wrote them before? No, they have the previous version. So they won't, okay. they won't have this product. Um, I'll cancel it and write a new one. I'm got, joking. You got to be careful. With <laughs> 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 new underwriting. So gotcha. Things like that, so be careful. But the point is, more competitive across the board, and then pay your bill. And we'll pay target premium, basically, what's your commissionable premium? Basically, about a 20% increase. So offer a competitive product and get paid more. Win win. We want win win win. We'll win, you win, you win. Uh, this is cool. It shows that this level is, is all about flexibility. Long story short, uh, you can start out with 